What's going on guys, Bob here back with some Undead Nation Last Shelter, so let's get into this. Uh, not too sure what to expect, but thought I might as well try out some Halloween-esque games. Um, yeah, they already have a Halloween theme and stuff like that, but uh, I honestly don't know what the game is about. I just downloaded a bunch of like zombie-like games and stuff like that for Halloween, of course, so we're going to be putting those out over the next week and uh yeah so let's get into this if you guys do like the video that would be nice also you guys can share subscribe hit the notification bell you know all those things help me out a lot if you have any other games you want to play let me know and i'll get to those eventually um yeah let's get into it so looks like we're gonna start off with uh some very interesting music honestly um Okay, so it looks like it's going to be like sort of the build the shelter like game. I mean, there could be other aspects where you got pumpkins and stuff. Um, yeah, I just thought I might as well play some stuff to do with Halloween. It's coming up and uh, I just downloaded whatever, honestly. It, this one actually had like the whole zombie or Halloween zombie thing going on already for their event, so I was like, I might as well just go with this one first, so, um, yeah, don't know, yeah, see, look, they already got the, I'm pretty sure later it's not gonna look like this, probably gonna be regular zombies, but, uh, for Halloween, they already have the whole theme going on, which I do like, drag here, yeah, which I do like, so, I decided to check it out and uh, so far it looks pretty good. It is an interesting game. Looks like we're probably going to be building a shelter in said house or yeah that's probably what it is. We got like a tree. I thought it was just zombies but apparently there's other stuff besides zombies. Um, interesting. Oh do we... Wait, well, do, do we have to shoot that or was that... Oh no, I kind of moved it, but I wasn't sure if that was me moving it or if it just moved on its own. I don't know, we'll try that out again when we do get a chance. So far I like it, even if it wasn't like Halloween themed or anything like that, I probably would check it out because it does look pretty interesting. Um... Looks like we're going to be building some sort of base. Probably going to have to go raid other ones and clear out locations and stuff like that. Looks like we're going to have to build up our resources as well. So uh, that's apparently what we're doing now. Yeah, if you guys have any other games you want to play, let me know. Because I'm pretty much just playing whatever. Like... I was going with anime related games first, uh, I'm still going to be playing those of course, and then I started to just go from there, and then currently right now, we got the Halloween themed games, like there's a ton of them on the Play Store, so I was like, might as well just download a bunch of them, hopefully some of them are actually pretty good, and go from there. Alright, so, looks like these are going to be the houses we're rating, chapter 1. Stage one of one. So it looks like we have multiple different stages. Don't know exactly how this is going to work. Um, looks like we have to make a party. I don't know how many characters. Because it looks like we can carry a ton of characters. But um, it looks like we have a certain amount of BP. So like this guy costs six. We could probably trade him out for two other ones. But of course uh, they won't let you currently... Alright, we're gonna start off with him. Can we put him up top? No. Should we just pretty much drag all the characters? That's all of them, right? Yeah, we have all of them. I do like the graphics too. I, I honestly don't know what uh, what they change for like the whole event. I wonder what they would do for the Christmas one though. Have like Christmas zombies or something? <laughs> Cause I got the the pumpkin ones. Victory. 
got uh, some food, some stone, some scraps. Probably gonna have to collect characters as well. Um, go back to base camp. That looks freaking sick. Like the art and like some of the stuff looks freaking amazing. Like the art design. Some of the characters look pretty sick as well. Some of them are just pretty normal, but uh, some of them actually look pretty cool. Don't open. Oh, we upgraded our house. Now we got like a freaking mansion. Oh, we gotta enter a name. Ooh. We're gonna put that. I was gonna try biohazard, but somebody probably already took that for sure. Uh, they do have events going on, of course. They have the Halloween event going on, which uh, we'll get into, but. Um, oh, my thing is full. Living room. Clean. Finish now. Clean. Finish now. Looks like you can go up to a certain point and clean. Like uh, a certain amount of time. I don't know exactly what the timer is for free. But I'm guessing probably under a minute or something like that is going to be free. Pretty much just going to clean everything. Make sure it's done for when we have to build stuff. Um... Let's put that right next to this one, because that's going to be in the same thing, so it makes it into a bigger one. Uh, what's here? Map? Do we have... No, we do not. We have Recycle Center. Uh, food, Headquarters, Recycle Center's right here. It's like... Living room. Can we move this? No. What else do we have to build? Um... Living room, Infirmary... Operations. What is this one? Mat Depot. I'm gonna put the infirmary up at the top. There we go. Medicine. Looks like we can get some painkillers. Um, I'm pretty much just trying to figure out what we're supposed to be doing. Because, uh, yeah, pretty much just winging it at this point because I don't know exactly what we're living room. Do we already have a living room? Which one's the living room? Food, dining. That's the living room. I really wish we could, like, switch these around. That'd be cool if we could move them around so we can connect them, but... Um, what else do we have? Ops. And then the other one was Recycle Center. Alright, I guess we're just gonna have to build these like this. Ops, and then I guess Recycle Center there. Alright, let's just put the living room up at the top. And then we'll put the Recycle Center down here. Yeah, that kind of sucks that we can't, like, uh, do anything with them. Alright, so it looks like we can recruit people. It's gonna take 45 minutes and 700. This is basic recruit. And then you can go up from there. Damn, five hours, a hundred, almost three hundred thousand and eight hours. Okay. Um, I guess let's recruit somebody. Uh, looks like we can speed up the recruit. S Forty-three gold. So out of speed up tickets, looks like you can actually have speed up tickets as well. We're actually gonna go to this one and do the same thing. Cause I'm pretty sure we're gonna need more characters. We do have 280 gold. I don't know if that's any good or not. Um What is this? I, I don't know, we have that stuff. I don't know what it's for. Uh these are gonna be the events. Looks like we have a logging log in event. Can't talk today for some reason. Um Looks like it's a six day event. We have some free stuff that they're going to be giving us. I'm guessing it's going to be different when the Halloween event is over because it lasts till the first. But currently they're giving away this character here, which is Halloween themed. Um, I'm guessing if you don't play during the Halloween event, I'll probably give out just like a normal character. Uh, pumpkin patch. Looks like you can collect some coins and then trade those out for a variety of different things although you have to be a certain level so there is that as well um haunted road looks like top up will get you some stuff five bucks five minute times ten level one and then it goes up from there and it looks like you can actually 
spend 150 bucks for a freaking character? Are you serious? Like, the, the character should be like five bucks or like a dollar. Like, 150? Are you freaking kidding me? That's insane, man. Ugh. Um. Oh, it looks like we can upgrade some stuff here if we need to. Or we can actually unlock some stuff. Cost 1500 though. I'm not going to do that just because... I don't know how, like, the food is going to work. We should probably upgrade this as well. 3,200, we don't have enough. Never mind. Uh, what else do we have? Cancel. Um, usable items. Looks like we have a shop as well. And we have a ton of different characters that you can actually get. So, we have... The flash offer, it looks like you get three characters, or do you get one uh, random? I'm not too sure. I think you get three, and then you get some gold, and then whatever the hell that is. Um, and then there are other packs. That's a $10 pack. This is a $100 pack. Uh, $5 pack. $50 pack. Brawler level up. Pack one. Five bucks. Level pack two. Three. Survivor pack. Speedy construction pack. Oh, doctor, my doctor pack, 50 bucks. That's insane. Um, survivors? It looks like you can actually pay to get to some survivors depending upon uh, how much you actually want to spend. So you have the premium recruit, which is one survivor, grade 2 to 4, level 1 to 10. So it's random in between there. That's 450. And then you have the premium recruits, which is 5 plus 1 survivor, so 6 survivors, grade 2 to 4, and 1 to 10, which is... 2250 add survivor slots which currently I guess we have 20 and then you can add five more for 50 um, and then they have the Halloween characters which I guess you don't have to pay for because these guys are in packs but I guess you can get them from here and not pay for the the packs that they're in although you would still have to pay 2250 which I don't know how much that is we have the gold coming up so we'll see here in a sec how much that's gonna be costing uh, one day builder which is 450, seven day builder, which is 900, permanent builder, which is 3000. If you're gonna go for a permanent one, or if you're gonna go for a builder, I would go for the permanent one, even though it costs 3K, just because why buy the seven day one when you could just save up and get the permanent one and you won't have to worry about it again. And then gold, so how much is that, 3K? So gold is gonna be starting off as 90 per dollar. So it's almost one for one, but not quite. Um, honestly, they should have just made it one for one. It would have been perfectly fine. But, uh, we have five bucks, which is 470, 900, 2000. So you'd need to buy basically 20. You, you'd probably just have to buy the $50 pack to get the 3000 for the builder. Um, and then 11,000 for 100. That's pretty crazy. And then we do have resources, 10% material, which is going to be 7. I'm guessing it's 10% of material you can carry. So I guess the higher the level, the better off you're going to, or the more you're going to get, I guess. So, interesting. 50% of the material or max material. And then uh, we have the premium supply boxes. Oh, they actually have supply boxes. For just $10, you can get a whopping total of 4,500 gold. <laughs> They make it sound like it's good or something. 30 day premium supply box subscription. Get twice the base camp supply box rewards. Get 50 gold for each premium supply box every day for 30 days. I'm guessing you have to be on every day for 30 days as well to get that. And then it comes out to a total of 4,500 for 10 bucks. It's actually a pretty good pack if uh, you're going to be playing, although it's 10 bucks. Honestly, they would add made it like five that would have been so good um so yeah there's a ton of different packs ton of different stuff to go for if you want to go that route honestly up to you but uh what else do we have we have just a bunch of random stuff um should probably produce more of those probably gonna need them we have those um what else do we have Oh, it looks like we have alliances as well. We have campaign, raid, urban warfare. Um, I guess we should just go to the campaign now. 
I don't know. Yeah, let's just go to the campaign because we need more stuff. And we do get gold because we do happen to get some gold every once in a while, so that is nice. Um, we have three heals. Looks like we can carry two more. Honestly, I don't know if it's better to take him out and carry two other people or... But yeah, let's just go. We'll drop him. Drop her. Bam. We do have the heal as well. I guess I should use the heal at the top or something like that. Or if we come up against a boss, we'll use the sniper. Guys taking quite a bit of damage. They're only level 1. We've got to figure out how to actually level them up as well. Alright, there's the... Let's heal. Damn, I should have used the heal first, so that way we could have started to get more HP back. I mean, it's still going up. I don't know if it matters, though. Does it count it? Hmm, I don't know. Because we gotta heal, if we don't heal during that, we actually have to heal our characters. Alright, let's go back to base camp. I want to see if we can level these characters up somehow. Because level 1 kind of sucks. Halloween 2018. Okay, cool. We got some more gear. I don't know what the gear's for. It's <laughs> like random stuff. Are these achievements? Oh, these are our characters, I think. Oh, alright, these are characters you can get, I guess. Zombies. Do we actually get zombies or no? What does this do? Wait, what is this for? Oh, these are for like. Wait, are these all our characters? Should we put them in stuff or no? I mean, this guy's in the food. Remove all. I really wish we could move these, like move the material one with the recycle ones, connect those two. Um, yeah, I don't know if we should like be putting these in here or not. HP, DPS, melee slash. Like, I don't know if it does anything. Like, it just protects your thing, maybe? Like, if somebody comes and attacks? I think that's what happens. I don't know. Let's we'll just put it like that. So, they're split up. Let's keep going, I guess. Because I don't know how to get to the characters. Wait, is there a character tab somewhere that I missed? Hold up. Right, can we like click the characters? No. Uh, I mean, we could upgrade though. Should we upgrade this, which will give us more food? Food headquarters. The headquarters is the core facility that unlocks other facilities as it progresses in level. We should probably go with that. 45, perfect amount. Um, it's gonna take five minutes, which would be 14. Cycle center. Is this all? Yeah, pretty much. 11 minutes on that. Collect. Characters? So these are characters? These are characters. Alright, heal. So we could heal. We're not going to, of course. Upgrade. Looks like it requires some metals or something. How do we upgrade our character overall, though? Can we? Is there a way to upgrade this thing? Get more HP? It's just that. Requires that. I don't know where to get those. Alright, let's just keep going with the campaign, I guess. I don't know if I should heal him or not. We'll go through one more. We'll go through one more. So it looks like we have 10 zombies on this one. The thing is... Should I... Find a place in slots. Not enough battle points. Yeah, should I get rid of him and add two more? I mean, because he's a tank, so we could put him in the front and then we can have an extra character. Let's try that on this one and see what happens. So, let's just do it like this. So they're in order. Put him, him, him. And then we have 1300. We'll go with him. 
attack. Of course, he'll be first. Then we got the gunners. And then... Change the direction of camera. We do have the heal on the thing, so... We'll use the heal when we get to the top. See, he doesn't tank as much damage as that other guy, though. That's the problem. Hmm. I really want to heal him. It's just they're not going to stay in one spot until we hit a boss, so... And I'm guessing the boss is going to be up at the top, so we'll just wait. Alright, we're probably going to have to heal right here. Come on. Where's this thing at? Nothing? Mm, didn't even get to use the skill. I mean, we healed a little bit. I don't know if that was better or not. I mean, yeah, we did more damage and stuff, but... Hmm. You know what, let's just keep going. Hmm. Can we throw these guys on different levels? No, we always have to start from here. Come on. I wonder if we can heal multiple times. Because we have enough energy, it's just I don't know if it does uh, if it lets you. Actually I'm gonna start healing and see if it does. It does, it does let you heal multiple times. Oh this guy's gotta heal, we have eight seconds. Uh oh, we might actually lose this character. I don't know how much it's gonna cost to like kill a dead character. Let's just wait for it. Actually, let's just heal here. Thank god I started healing there. Victory! We got more 3k for that? Holy crap. I mean, we can keep going as well. I don't know if it's worth it though. Hmm. Let's go back to the base camp. This thing's still not done. Collect, collect. Collect. Oh, we're maxed on that. What do we have? We have some gear. Um. Tactics. Alright, it looks like we can do one of these. Throws a flashbang that stuns all enemies within range. Pumps all allies with ranged, increase their attack speed by 30%. That actually sounds pretty good. Should we stun enemies? Or should we increase our attack? Because stunning them only hits for two, two seconds. Increasing our attack is three seconds, so we're going to be doing a crap ton more damage. I think we should actually go for that. Um... Single target. I think we should actually put this one on. Enable. Instead of that. The only reason I don't like this one as much is because it only targets one. That's why this one's going to be a little bit better. Can unlock that as well. I mean, we don't need to, but we could. 13 seconds. Free. Looks like we're going to get more stuff. Bam. Look at that. Gas and oil. Base 3. Recycle. Living room. We gotta clean. Clean. Cancel. Clean. Free. Clean. Free. Is that it? Is that all we got? Yeah, all these are good. What is this? Infirmary? I wonder if we can build another infirmary. Oh, we got the material. We got food. We have living room, and that's it. Living room, we can actually add another living room here. What's that living room? 
Bam. So it connects to both of those recruits. Let's do another one. We can upgrade it though. Actually, it's built recycled. Do we have a recycle center? No, we got material and we got food. And then we have a fitness infirmary. I'm gonna put the fitness up here at the top, I guess. What is this recycle? Empty. I really wish we could move these around. Material and food. I mean, we're gonna have to build both of them. Right, let's just put the material. And then we'll put the food up here, I guess. That kind of sucks that we can't uh, do anything with them. All right, so we have 2,000, 2,000. Um, what else we got? News inbox. Um, that's it. We have raids unlocked now. Find a match. Looks like you can raid other people's bases. Which we're not going to do, of course. And then... Have we still not leveled up our characters? Yeah, I don't think these guys... Yeah, they're still level 1. Kill all 15 of these? Really? My god. That costs so much to heal. I don't know where to get those medals, though. What should we be- should we upgrade this again? Or try to? I mean, that seems like the best thing to upgrade. Training? Oh, right here! This is where you can actually upgrade them. Probably go with him. Speed up. Oh, that's gonna take a minute. The reason I went with him is because we're using him as our tank, so we kind of need him to be a little bit more so it can cost 4,000 to upgrade that what is this? it says process oh we got a free box just material though need more? it's gonna take 5 hours to actually get that I guess you get a free one every once in a while we have gas oh I didn't know you could do that it's like clicking on random stuff. Is there any more zombies or anything around? Just click some random stuff, see if there's anything else we missed. I think we're good. Click that, click that. Huh. Yeah, they should let you move this stuff around. Make it a lot easier on us. Right, this guy's almost done. Did we get something? Completed. There we go. Level 2. How much is it going to cost to get to level 3? 2800. Holy balls. Like, what? Not enough. 3200 for that. Looks like we're going to have to go to the campaign unless you want to raid. Which I don't want to do. Alright, what do we have here? Ooh, we have 6 now. Oh, we should definitely put him on. Yeah, let's go. I'll throw the two tanks in the front, of course. Bam, 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 bam. And then we'll get it up to get him here in a second. There we go. Let's do this. Should probably heal. Or try to heal. Bam. Oh, she didn't get included. Crap. Mm, it increased their attack quite a bit. I don't know if it was- damn, this guy's almost dead. Heal. Heal, baby, heal, 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 heal. We'll go on attack. Ready? Ready? Go! Nine seconds. Nine seconds. Oh no! Four! Three! Let me get off the hill! Let me get off the hill! 
Oh, I don't think I got it off. No, I did. I did. I got it off. I don't know if it counts, though. Yeah, I think it did count. Although we're still gonna have to heal these guys because they're freaking expensive as hell. Alright, let's go back to peace camp. Damn, those guys are really strong. We're gonna have to level them up. So we got some more painkillers. Let's make some more. Produce. Bam. Um. Got some more gear. Which, oh, now we know what the gear is for. It's for this. To train. Um. Hmm. Should probably go with one of the gunners. We'll go with her just because I like her a little bit better. I don't know if it's better than him though. But I'm gonna go with her. Just because I like her over the other guy, that's basically it. And then we can up oh, I was gonna say we upgrade this, we don't have enough. Hmm. Damn, everything's expensive. I guess we're gonna upgrade the recycling. Which would definitely give us a lot more. I really want to just level up the headquarters, which would be 8,500. We're so close. I'm guessing one more of the, the campaigns would do it. Let's go do one more, I guess. Although we'd have to heal all. How many of these do we even have? Like, the survivor has no injury. Where do we get the, the meds from? Are those the painkillers? Is that what we're using? How many would you like to open? 100 medicine. Oh! One, one of those is 100? Oh, oh, the healing is nothing! I thought that- okay, never mind. I thought one of those medicines was one of those packs or something. That's easy! Yo, let's go! Yeah, we're gonna go do another one I can- what? I didn't know that. I would have been healing him this whole time. I'm over here worrying about HP and stuff. <laughs> three? Three? Ah, oh, I was hoping they would give us another three. Let's go. Let's attack. We're gonna use him. Bam. 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 And then we'll pull out the, the other tank here in a second. There we go. Bam. Enemies left, battle ends, withdraw. Looks like this is what we can get, available loot. Mm. Should we heal? Yeah, let's heal. Thank god I healed. And then we'll attack up here and there. We gotta upgrade those. We gotta upgrade more of our characters. If we can just get enough for the headquarters one more time, that'd be perfect. Two seconds. Let's go. Taking a little bit of damage. Try the stunning one. I wonder if that one's a little bit better. We're gonna heal. We don't really have to worry about healing. Yeah, I thought it was a lot worse. It wasn't even that bad. You can actually make it through the campaign pretty quick, honestly. Just gotta remember to level up your characters and stuff. It's the main thing, leveling up characters. Alright, we have enough to do the headquarters yet again, so we're gonna do that. It's gonna take 18 minutes. Um, I would also prioritize getting this leveled, but uh, leveling up your character is probably another good thing to do. Um, I don't know if it's better just to stick with one and keep leveling this guy up, or level up across the board. Probably across the board is gonna be better, just because you're gonna use all these characters. Let's go with him, I guess. HP and DPS. And, uh, yeah, we do have recruits going. 
and yeah, that's pretty much it. I think that's going to be about it for this one. Um, we just can continue with the campaign and stuff like that. Let me know what you guys think of the game. It's an interesting game. I could probably continue playing in this stuff, but uh, we're going to go try some other games. If you guys have any other games you want to play, let me know. If you did make it this far, thank you guys for watching. That's pretty insane. Uh, if you guys could like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and you know all the things that help me out a lot, I would appreciate it. We'll talk to you guys later.